So today's video is going to be a how to get fuller lips video. I'm just showing you my tips and tricks that I use when I want fuller pouty lips. It doesn't take very many products at all. Honestly, you probably have all these products laying around your house somewhere. So I hope you all like this video and let's get started with the tutorial. So first you want to take an old toothbrush, any toothbrush works, and some exfoliator. I'm going to be using the True Blue from Bath & Body Works exfoliator. And you want to exfoliate your lips so we can get all the dead skin off and have a nice good base for our lipstick. So, I'm going to And just and then if you buy a sink you can just rinse it off with water but I'm just gonna use a paper towel okay so next we're gonna moisturize and it's really important to moisturize your lips before applying lipstick because sometimes your lip can be all cracked and when it gets dry, it's just going to absorb all of that, all of your lipstick and make it look all cracked. So. And by the way, I'm using the Nivea Lip Butter. Okay, so now you want to take a lip liner. It's best to use a lip liner that is about the color of your lips, if not a little bit darker. You don't want it to be a completely different color than your lips, though, because that's just going to look really bad. So right here I have three lip liners that I think would work best. And this one is from Revlon, and it's in the shade Natural. This is from Revlon, and it's in the shade Nude. And then I have Rimmel's Addiction. And today I am going to be using Revlon's Nude. Start lining your lips with that nude lip liner. And we are going to we are going to overdraw. Okay, so start at your cupid's bow. And I have a more pointy cupid's bow, so you can round it out if you want. See, the way my lips are, they're pointing and then they go straight down. So instead of drawing straight down, you can kind of curve it. And we're just going to do the same thing to the other side. To ma and make sure you're overdrawing just a little bit. You don't want to go too crazy. And then with your bottom, go right below your natural lip. I never overdraw the outsides, but you can overdraw the bottom. And then you want to completely fill in your lips with the lip liner. Okay, so now you want to take your lip color, and I will be using CoverGirl's Romance Mauve, and completely fill in your lips. And then I'm going to take a lighter nude 
And this is Maybelline's Raw Reveal. And I'm going to dab this in the center of my lips. You want to blend that out with your finger. Back in with your lip liner and just go over that line we drew. And I always fill in the outsides. And now we are going to take bronzer. Make sure you're using a matte bronzer. And I'm just going to use this little brush I got out of a palette of mine. Not a palette, a compact. And dust some off. I'm using the Milani bronzer, XL bronzer. And you just want to take this underneath this bottom lip. Like that. This is just going to create a shadow under your lip and make the bottom lip look, look, make the bottom lip look more pouty. Now we're going to take a highlighter and I'll be using Physicians Formula Translucent Pearl. You can take any highlighter that you want. And I will be using a flat shader brush. And you want to highlight your cupid's bow. And this is the final result. I hope this video helped you all out and I hope you learned something new. If you have any video requests, please leave them in the comments below. Make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.